Hi, welcome to the Photoman uh, YouTube channel. Uh, we will be removing the background uh, from this image and change the background. So to do it, uh, we will use the quick selection tool and uh, we are using uh, Photoshop CS5. So let's make it 30, around 30 for starting and just start a quick selection it would be a rough one and we can fix any problems later as uh, a rough selection is done we need to remove these over selected areas here we go mm, this of un under selection correct this using plus brush um here an extra so it's kind of smart selection it automatically correctly selects the things we have a bit of under selection here we can just again come back and fix this over selected area here is a bit of over selected area so you have to get it right at this moment uh so Results will be better later in that case. Bit of over selection here. Just will remove this. Bit of edge here. This is fixed. Again, bit of under selection you can fix here. Otherwise, it looks good. And uh, bit of over selection here. fix this under selection so w when you are done and you are satisfied with your, uh, your selection just click the refine edges button and go to show radius you don't have any radius selected right now radius kinda improves your selection tells where the edges so um, it improves it and smart radius check this checkbox so back to our image already is just, just telling this is the radius <coughs> let's make the edges bit of smooth let's add bit of feather to it not too much increase the uh, contrast a bit smooth to bit less uh, okay let's decrease the feather and smooth bit more contrast bit more so we are very much done with our uh, background removal thing new layer with layer mask this is the best option at least I like it okay so we're back to a layer where uh, there is a mask at the layer so we can just see our object or our person not the background so what we will do no the uh, interesting thing or better thing here is uh, we can select this mask and uh, we can uh, paint it white to bring out the more detail and uh, black to take the details away so I will just show you this you have to take the paint brush and just uh, with black selected if you do this our details are going away, away. I will hit the control Z okay uh, with uh, the white selected you can bring the detail back I will again do control Z this uh, was a just to show you stuff so uh, we have the mask selected here this is important so uh, we need to bring bit of detail back around here so I will do this and this is already just kinda done yeah you don't we don't have to take anything away at any point a bit of here so I will switch it to black color and we take a uh, uh, small size brush uh, which start painting with the fear to take this detail away from here mm. 
not let's take the opacity real down and let's take less harsh brush I know it will do help us yeah it worked fine you can always just keep doing it until you're satisfied so I'm done with this image let's uh, bring put another background so copy an image from anywhere else and just paste it paste it here uh, so our background image is not really uh, the same size so we will go to edit uh, make sure the layer of background image is selected uh, added free transform and just uh, hold the shift key so it uh, retains its original aspect ratio and key start uh, resizing your image uh, again shift and resize this is about it S uh, for me it will do okay press enter uh, bring this layer back on the back uh, below this layer so this thing the original layer comes on top and here we go uh, it was very easy process and uh, not much of hard work and we are done uh, image is already looking good so keep coming back to photoman youtube channel youtube.com slash photoman we will be coming back with uh, more tutorials. Thank you. Uh, give your comments below and uh, any response videos are welcome. Thank you.